All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Hell's Paradise episode three. In the last episode, we were well introduced to many uh, prisoners, so many of people that were on death row for their crimes, whatever they may be. Um, and it went came down to the fact that they needed to shorten the numbers, reduce the numbers. Um, so yeah, the the shogun basically said, "Y'all need to kill each other." Reduce it down to 10, which they did. And now the 10 that are left are more mean character-esque. Quite a few of them over here on this side, probably. Um, yeah, it's really cool. Gabi Mario absolutely popped the fuck off. He's a demon. Um, and now they have arrived with their partners, the Yamada clan, I believe, um, to this heaven, heavenly island. Um, but yeah, very excited to see how this goes now. Um, so as always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh, Jesus Christ. What is happening to this dude? Yeah, he was stabbed in the head. That was the chief? Okay, um, uh, I see why he was in charge. So it is a real thing. Okay. How do we know it's here, though? Bro, they might sell this shit in, like, the local store or something. They just never found it. How did they assume it would just be on this heavenly island? Weakness and strength. Yeah. Probably. I mean, yeah, it does give off the vibes. It's a magical-looking place, considering where they came from. It's very unnatural. It's probably what leads prey in like that. Fuck the Shogun. He hasn't got the balls to come here. What if he has to fight or something? Bro, what's he supposed to do? You gotta work with me, man. If he wanted to kill you, he would've fucking done it by now. Man, you gotta be... You gotta work with him here. Your ass could die here as well if his hands are binded. What the fuck is that? Oh my god, he got fucking murked. Was this the giant guy? You think that was enough? Huh? Just cracked my neck. <laughs> Dislocated my neck. And explain to me why you're killing another criminal? And it does matter, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh wait, now Gabi Maru's hands aren't binded still. Yeah, for real. Let them go ham. Yeah. See? See? Is he just trying to like prove his strength? Is that why he's fighting Gabi Maru? What a freak. <laughs> yeah? Okay. Good luck with that, bro. I mean, he's not breaking any rules, I suppose. So the Yamada clan aren't going to get involved. <laughs> See? Oh, I'm so tired of this. I can't be bothered already. All right, let me wipe him out. Yeah, guess I'll kill you. Get fucked. <laughs> no, he's not binding his... Are you serious? I mean, he may as well bind his hands. Give the dude a handicap. <laughs> he didn't feel a thing from that. <laughs> oh my god, this guy's about to get fucked up. Oh. Oh shit. Oh, did I go right through him? Nah, Gabi Maru is fucking him, bro. This is ridiculous. Is he dead? Nope. Not yet. Oh, he's got armor. Wow. Armor sewn to his skin. That's crazy. Oh my god. Well, one down, nine, one down, eight to go. That's it. That's if he even needs to kill the others. He probably, some of them will probably be right in the head. Um. Oh, oh, he's going to take his head back. Yeah, fair enough. That was quick. <laughs> fair enough. You get paid either way. Yeah, for real. Bro's got the best job here. 
She is really a stickler for the rules, considering those binds stop him in no way. Oh shit, is Bakugo gonna die? Damn. Damn. Is she gonna... Yeah? Wow, okay. That was easy. Yeah. For real. That, and staying alive. And if his hands being unbinded keeps you alive, then keep his, keep them unbinded. This, this dude's spitting like crazy. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't attempt, boy. Yeah. You know what? You get to live. Take that head, go home. Go, go and get a bath. What the hell is he doing? Oh, tying the boat to the tree? Oh, this is the other giant dude. Okay. You're not thinking of eating him, are you? Oh, shit. Is he going to die? No way. Is he eating him? <gasps> Bro, they made this guy look fucking epic. And he died straight away. Let's go, Bakugo. Bitch, oh my god. That's fucking crazy. Wait, she's dead too? Or is she sleeping? I can't see. Bro, did like most of them just die off? That's crazy. Bro, she looked out with Gabi Maru. He's got his head screwed on, probably. What the hell is he doing? Why? Why would he do that? If he goes back without her, he dies. Bro, baby Gabi Maru just looking at his dead parents, man. That's so weird that he's not crying. I don't get what's happening. Why is he doing this? Yeah, oh, shit. So he needs to do this as fast as possible and she's holding him back? Yeah. Yeah, you just realized that? Good luck. I'm not gonna lie, she should have just let him have his hands free. Because she's not a bad person, maybe? <laughs> oh, I love that she's his weak spot. That's cute. She sees the good in him. Yeah, fair enough. Gotta take him out. Ain't nobody touching Bay. Damn. You almost had a chance there, bro. Ooh, shit. Why did you stop? He really can't kill her. She's not a bad person. Yeah, for real. The heart's a good thing, though. It makes you human. Oh, shit. He's hollow. Those eyes. Oh, shit. He's really going for the kill now. You can do it. She's right there. Oh, my God. That's fucking epic. What the fuck is this? Yeah, you, uh, you should know that by now. Oh, Yo. That's fucking awesome. God, she has so much influence over him. He really doesn't like killing. I'm really gonna like to see how these two bounce off each other, learn from each other, learn about themselves. Yo. That's good. I like that. Nice. Yep. You can do that. But by God, do not put that rope around his hands. So annoying. You're not hollow? Oh, yeah. That was nice. I like that. What the hell? Like Buddha statues. Uh, whatever that is, kill it. What the fuck? Oh shit, did it sting you? Chop your hand off. Get rid of it. 
Oh, he actually did! Fucking crazy bastard. Bro, keeping the blood from flowing out by squeezing his arm. Everything here wants to kill you. What Pokemon are these? Oh! Are you going to slice all of these butterflies? Bro. Bro. What? What the hell was the author on when he drew this shit? Oh, <laughs> Mushiro. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? Breakfast. <laughs> right, so that was Hell's Paradise Episode 3. Uh, I really loved the kind of dynamic between uh, Sagari and the Gabi Maru there. How they kind of learned from each other, try, actually started to understand one another. Well, Gabi Maru was more understanding himself. Sagari was helping him do that. Sagari was then learning from him and understanding herself as well. It was really cool. Uh, very, very nice. I like that the tension between them is kind of broken now as she starts to understand him more. Um, and he, of course, starts to understand himself. Um, yeah, this island's fucking crazy. Everything wants to kill you. That dude was very correct for slicing off his hand with no hesitation. Um, he, but he, he's going to need to... I don't know, he's got a little bit of a handicap now. So I was shocked as hell to see the, the amount of people that have died already, especially that red-haired dude. That's fucking crazy. I thought he was like him of the Yamada clan, but apparently not. Um, which is kind of funny, to be honest, because he was talking shit to Sagadi so much. But yeah, overall, a very good episode. I'm definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.